Bangalore has a really strong talent pool in terms of a technology community as well as a creative community. And bringing these worlds together can make magic happen. And for us at Jaga, where we're constantly trying to explore new audiences as well as new public spaces, this brings these worlds together. We think of it as, as a coming together of creative minds, pushing the envelope, the boundaries on art and design and technology, both for each other and together. Bengaluru Fantastic is a local event for public and everyone. Anyone can come in and participate, and that too for free. I think what Bengaluru Fantastic really succeeded in doing was to create uh, an experiential place for every kind of person in Bangalore. So people are open to new ideas and uh, new kinds of art, so I think it's uh, an amazing city to be in right now as an artist. people have moved beyond these structures and rigid labels. This is one of the most fantastic things that has happened in recent years where you have art and technology actually fusing with one another and presenting these little, little magical moments captured. I know that in a couple of years this is going to really become like a destination in the world and India will be jumping out to come to Bangalore around this time. The power of a civilization, the reflection of the development of a civilization is really for me not in money, not in the buildings that you build, but in the art that you create. The festival saw a lot of collaboration between local and international artists and I think it really challenged uh, people's idea of what constitutes a work of art. when these technologies are really pervasive and if art and design are really either political or personal or functional statements, how can technologies enhance and amplify these things? You know, we're in Bangalore, we're a little spoiled. We've taken a whole lot of things for granted. We've grown up taking a whole lot of things for granted. You could just be a normal guy on the street. You literally have the same levels of customizability of your assets, control of your assets that only the super rich enjoy. Um, and also, there are some very interesting conversations going on about, you know, art, public art, public art spaces. Other thing, as artists, if we don't engage with people uh, at places like this, then there won't be more infrastructure like this. And we we all know that you know, for a city like Bangalore that is growing at such an exponential pace, there's more and more need for public art spaces, and there's more and more need for us as artists to engage with people in these spaces. Water is connected, so one molecule of water is connected to the other.
really worked hard to make Bengaluru fantastic by pulling in together this Bangalore community of government players like Karnataka Tourism, like PMRCL, of private organizations that supported us in various capacities, of um, artists and technologists who came together to play together, of public that came to interact and engage with all of the various formats that we presented through the festival. Bangalore Fantastic is really aligned to United Nations Sustainable Development Goals and we together, all these people together and us, we together want to imagine this amazing, radical, open and optimistic future that's sustainable.